Hi there, gorgeous! Decluttering, decluttering needs to happen. I need to clear my head, my life, get it back on order. I promised you more decluttering videos. I have a whole blush drawer. I've got pigments out the wazoo. But I wanted to start with my perfume sample drawer. <laughs> which is really out of control. Odds are, if you're watching this video, then you're a perfume junkie like me. And I wanted to share the service Scentbird with you if you've not heard of them before. It's a monthly subscription service that allows you to sample perfumes. They have over 450 designer scents to choose from, so you never run out of new scents to try. And they also offer colognes for men too. They carry all of the top brands you can think of when it comes to perfume. Dolce & Gabbana, Gucci, Tom Ford, Prada, you name it, they carry it. And they give you a generous amount to try. So you're not left with thinking, is this going to work for me or not? By the time you're done with the sample vial, you know for a fact whether or not you're going to like that perfume. I got my box this month. So I wanted to share these with you as part of this sample collection here. First sample I got this month was the Salvatore Ferragamo Signorina in Fiore. This is one I don't personally care for. It's probably not going to be one that I'm going to be using, but that's why we try them out. We gotta see if we like them or not. Second sample that I got from Scentbird this month is the one from Tom Ford. This is the Black Orchid scent. When I first smelled it, I thought, oh, that's really pretty, but it doesn't mix very well with my personal body chemistry, and I didn't like how I smelt at the end of the day. Have you ever done that where you've worn a perfume all day and then by the end of the day you can't wait to wash it off because it doesn't smell that good on you? It smells really good when you spray it. It's, it's just not for you. But I did get one that I really do like and third time's a charm, right? This is the one from English Laundry. It's their Oxford Blue Pour Femme and that's exactly what it smells like. It smells like fresh, clean laundry. It's like being outside, which is such a, oh, it's really pretty. I have enjoyed wearing this one. So if you'd like to try Scentbird for yourself, I do have a discount code for you so you can try your first month's subscription for only $10. It is ZAB30. I will also have it linked for you below. Check it out, try it out. I'm just telling you now that it is addictive. And if you love perfumes, you're going to look forward to this box every single month. First sample I have here is Prada's Candy. Now this is a lot of perfume. This was a deluxe sample that I got with a Sephora order a while back. And this is the only thing I don't like about getting samples this size is when I don't like the perfume, I feel so guilty about throwing it out. And I don't like this one. It's not my favorite kind of scent. It's just too, I don't even know how to describe it to you. It's too yeesh. Is that a word? Yeesh, yeah, it's yeesh. Chanel, I believe I really loved this one. Which one is this? I don't even know. It doesn't have a name on it. Oh yes. Oh yes, come back, come back. That's one I'm saving. I wish I could reference a name of it for you. I'll show you the sample up close. Maybe you'll catch something that I'm not catching, but all it says is Chanel and that's it. But this is such an, oh, beautiful scent. Ooh, I want to spray more of it, but I probably shouldn't. My room is going to smell like a cheap department store by the time I'm done. Lancome La Vie est Belle. Yes, I do love this one. It's a very light, feminine floral scent. This is one that if I get all the way through this sample, I would consider purchasing the full size because I really love it. Versace Bright Crystal. Well, this one is half used up and I'm going to throw it out because I did buy the full size. So we can toss that. And while I'm looking at it, I have another Versace Bright Crystal. Again, only about a quarter of it left there. I'm gonna throw that one out too. DKNY Be Delicious Fresh Blossom. And this one is almost used up. Very little amount left in there. And I'm going to throw this one out because I purchased the full size of this one recently. I know, I said in my last video where I talked about Scentbird that I was gonna be on a no buy. 
I love that sample. I had to buy it. Betsy Johnson, Too Too Pretty. And this one is almost gone too. Very little amount left in there. I must have really liked this one, but I don't remember it. <laughs> no. Mm -mm. What was I thinking? <coughs> Whew. Elizabeth and James Nirvana White. Yeah, that was one I didn't really care for either. I don't know why I saved it. I'm going to toss that one. Versace Bright Crystal. <laughs> I have another one. I really don't need that many. Versace Yellow Diamond. I think this was another one that I really liked. Watch, it's gonna stink in here so bad by the time I'm done with this video. My husband is gonna come in here and he's gonna say, who are you trying to impress <laughs> or not impress? I'm gonna drive somebody away. Now, I didn't really care for this one either. I don't know why I saved it, so I'm gonna toss that. This is from Escada, Cherry in the Air. All right. Oh, that's pretty. It smells like cherries, <laughs> for lack of a better description. I like that. Oh, I'm gonna save that. Jimmy Choo, that's all it says, nothing else on it. Ugh, no, ugh, gone. Well, how do you like that? I got a sample here with no name on it, nothing. <laughs> I'm afraid to open it because I don't want to love it. Oh, I don't even like it, that's okay. I don't even know what it is. It's Lancome, la vie est belle. See, when I really love a sample, sometimes I get more than just one. <laughs> so now I have two samples of la vie est belle, which I can definitely use up in the future. And this is one from Rouge Bunny Rouge Vespers. Let's see what this one. Ha, ah, oh, you can really smell the alcohol in that one. I don't care for that one bit. Yuck. Ralph Lauren Romance. I don't smell you. I still don't smell you. I don't care for it anyway. I'm going to toss that one. Victoria's Secret Seduction Dark Orchid. A little pink sample there. I think I really liked all my Victoria's Secret samples. Oh yeah, I do like that. That is very pretty. I'm gonna save that one. Another Victoria's Secret sample here. This is very sexy. I think I really like, Oh, I'm still enjoying the last one. <laughs> She just hit me in the face again. Oh, that's pretty too. Victoria's Secret is really good with their perfumes and their body sprays. Simply Bell, no name. Not sure who makes it, mm, but I don't really like that. You can, again, smell the alcohol in it straight away. I don't like perfumes like that at all. Couture La La from Juicy Couture. I think I bought the full size of this one because I loved it so much and I went through Two samples of it. Yes, yes, that is exactly what that is. I'm gonna toss it simply because I have two of those perfumes full size, so I don't need to save a sample of it. Marc Jacobs Dot. This is one I bought the roller ball of, and after I wore it for a while, I didn't care for it. So I, the roller ball has like half left in it too, but I'm gonna toss the sample because not for me. Body by Victoria. Nah, I think I really loved this one. Oh yes. Oh yes. Oh, come here. Oh, not in my eye. <laughs> Victoria's Secret Angel. Oh, that's pretty too. That's very light and airy. Oh, I love it. Love, love, love. I'm going to save that one. Victoria's Secret Bombshell. I don't know if I can spray any more perfumes. It's getting a little heavy in here. I have to spray them or I can't smell them. Ooh, that's nice. I like that. I'm gonna save that. Modern Muse from Estee Lauder. Mm -mm, no. This one is Dolce & Gabbana Light Blue. Thankfully, it's not one we have to spray. Ugh. No. I don't care for that one either. I'm gonna to toss that. Another no-name sample. I'm not even gonna smell it because I have a feeling I'm gonna like it. It's almost used up. All right, what else do we have here? Pink sugar. That's all it says is pink sugar. Oh, that was one I really liked too. I'm going to save that. 
Ah, I have a second pink sugar. <laughs> I must have really liked it. This is a perfume from Selena Gomez. That's all it says. Oh. Ooh, that smells like sweet tarts candy. Oh, that is beautiful. I like that a lot. Exceptional because you are. And that's all this little perfume sample says. Ugh, no. Ugh. Oof. Well, you are not exceptional, little perfume sample. Ugh. Last sample here is Gucci's Bamboo, and I have a feeling I really liked this one. Yes. Oh, yes. I really <laughs> don't like the taste of it, but I really like the way it smells. <laughs> Thank goodness this is the last video of the night because I got to get out of here now. Woo. Well, I'm pretty proud of myself. I feel like I decluttered a lot, and my little drawer there went from being completely full to now i only have that many <laughs> i told you i'm a junkie well i hope you enjoyed decluttering with me today let me know what your most favorite scent is and which one you could never be without thank you so much for taking the time to watch and i look forward to seeing you again in another declutter video very soon